In this video, we're going to be talking about the benefits and best practices of routine inspections. Coming right up. Welcome back to this video and today I have with me Lee McLennan, our Senior Property Manager here at Auckland Property Management. Thanks for joining us, Lee. Oh, it's lovely to be here, Sheldon. Right. And in this video, we're going to be talking about the benefits and best practices of routine inspections. Now, we're shooting this video in two parts. So we start off with the benefits um, of routine inspections. Now, could you share with us what are some of the benefits of uh, doing routine inspections and inspections in general? So inspections, um are a necessity and if you fail to do them you're going to have huge ramifications from that. So first one would be insurance. So a lot of insurance company um, in this day and age are not um, meeting your insurance requirements if you haven't done three monthly or four monthly inspections. If there is an incident at the house and you can't prove what the condition of the house was previously you will not be awarded um, your insurance claim. Um, the second one is, is obviously preventative maintenance. Um, you know, for the cost of fixing a pipe, could be $100, where if you let it run for a long time, you could end up with a $30,000 house renovation because it's ruined your floors. So it, it seems um, like something, well, do we really need to do it? Uh, tenants don't always see little things that are happening where you're going in independently, you're seeing it, you're addressing it, we're getting on with it. I've been in the business so we were. I had brown hair when I started actually. So, um, and when I started we had a pen and paper and we wrote down inspections and then we went from there and, and we um, did some photos and we sent them. And as a company we've evolved and we now do video inspections. The advantage of that is transparency. With the other forms of inspections you've got a little small picture of what was going on. With a video, just like you get to see me today, um, you get the opportunity to go through your house, and I have a ditty. Um, I always say you can walk through your properties four times a year without leaving the comfort of your chair. A lot of my owners are overseas, they're in uh, many parts of the world, and they like the comfort of actually having somebody walk them through the house, show them what's happening, and from that point of view they can actually see a fault themselves that we might not have picked up. They may have lived in the house and think, oh, something's not quite right there. Mm -hmm. So from a property manager point of view, transparency, insurance, it covers it quite well. And from us, it allows us to interact with the tenant as well and make sure that they are looking after the house well. Thanks for sharing all that information with our viewers and I hope that was helpful to all our viewers. Now we will be uh, going into the second part of this video, uh, which is about the best practice of routine inspections. So we'll see you in the next video.